good morning in today's video i will tell you about the steps to write a diary entry so the emotional records of the past events with reference to the personal expression wrapped by creative thoughts that is the ultimate illustration of a diary writing so a diary it is maintained by a person um uh, it is uh, his personal uh, memories so it is a summary of of, a th- of the things that occurred on a particular day in a person's life so it gives us a glimpse of the past incidents in a person's life so this uh, piece of writing it is one of the most personal and informal categories of writing so this can be based on uh, a scene an experience a description a narration or any other activity that the writer considers um worth in his personal diary so this uh, diary entry that i am going to the steps that i'm going to tell you to write a diary entry please adhere adhere to those steps so that uh, you can score good marks uh, in your diary entry so now we'll discuss about the steps to write a diary entry so writing a diary entry it is a wonderful way just to keep the old memories on your of your past so if you follow these steps so this will help you to write a perfect diary entry so the first step that we are going to follow is event or incident so the diary entries they are based on the events incidents that affect the writer in an emotional way so there are emotions like anger uh, happiness sadness that provoke a person to share his feeling so uh, these feelings they uh, um, the writer he shares in his personal diary so when he is sharing all these emotions he is sharing uh, with his diary that can confide everything so that is the time the incidents the events of the day they have to be in chronological order because the diary uh, is always made at the end of the day or an event so you just have to keep this in mind the second thing that you have to keep in mind is day date and time so when you start mention the date the day and the time also and it is uh, like uh, you have to follow a format that is prescribed by cbsc so what you are going to do is first of all you ha- you can you have to write the date so like you can write 27 may 2020 then write the date sorry day day is wednesday then write time time please uh, like whenever you are writing the time please try and write pm because the diary is written at the end of the day do not write early in the morning the diaries are always written at the end of the day so please try and write pm and uh, then after that comes greeting so whenever you write a diary greet your diary warmly before writing the entry so you can write dear diary so you can greet your diary by writing dear diary then after that you write content so make sure when you are writing the content all the important details in the main uh, are there in the main content of the entry so you have to stress on your feelings the emotions the reactions rather than on the event itself then as you know that this is an informal style of writing so diary is written to express the innermost feeling about people the events the place so it should be written in an informal style uh, 
like you can consider the diary to be your best friend with whom you can share all the uh, deepest thoughts the feelings the emotions the desires and uh, you can just confide everything into your diary so please uh, try and follow the informal style of writing and now uh, like when you uh, uh, end so that time also you have to be very polite when you sign off so you can write see you uh, later talk to you later so this gives an interesting edge but don't forget to write your name or the name that is mentioned in the question at the end of the diary so you have to sign off writing your name also so now now a look at the points to be kept in mind while writing the diary entry so you have to use informal and personal style of writing so as it is an event of the past so you have to use the past tense the uh, content it is to be in different paragraphs so while writing the diary you have to be very creative um, and then you have to share exactly how you feel stress on the emotions the feelings uh, rather than stressing on the event and the most important is you have to stick to the word limit that is 100 to 120 words so now i'll give you uh, to write a diary entry and what you have to do is you've read the poem amanda and now what you are going to do is like you know after reading the poem you know that amanda is a small girl and it is uh, like this poem it is about the uh, liberty in life so this girl she is instructed always not to bite her nails not to hunch her shoulders and she wishes like she can just move around she can roam about freely in the dusty streets so now uh, what you have to do is like she is yearning for freedom so now you have to imagine yourself as amanda and you have to express your feelings in the form of a diary entry so please follow these points and write a diary entry